Hey guys, welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be ranking how good of friends I would be with every single quarterback in the NFL. So we've got best friends, close friends, friends, acquaintances, and hating them. So first, let's start off with Josh Allen. You know what? I think Josh Allen's a pretty cool dude. I would say we'd be pretty close friends. Seems like a nice guy out the field. Seems like a pretty fun dude. I love his mustache, dude. He's a smiling guy. Like the Bills. Always been a big fan of Josh Allen, and I think we'd be pretty good friends. I think we'd hang out a lot, and it'd be cool. Uh, Jacoby Brissett, he is not the starter, so let's put him down there. We have got Derek Carr. I would be close friends with Derek Carr. He's such a nice guy off the field. Cool guy on the field. Really put up with the crap for the Raiders, from the Raiders. And really... I don't know. He's been a really loyal contributor to the Raiders, and now hopefully he'll be loyal to the Saints. And I respect loyal people, and I think we would be very good friends, and I think uh, everything would be pretty cool between us two. I think it'd be cool to be friends with Derek Carr. Uh, da Dak, I would be friends with Dak. Uh, I don't have anything against Dak. I just don't like how he's on the Cowboys. That just affects everything. I know... It's not his fault he was drafted by the Cowboys, but it's his fault that he's still on the Cowboys. He could ask to trade or something. But I still think Dak's a pretty cool dude. Said a lot of nice things about other people, you know, other quarterbacks. Uh, he seems really nice. Uh, Sam Darnold. Gosh, I don't like this guy for some reason. I don't know why. I'd say acquaintances. He's kind of like that guy I'd say like in the hallway. I'd just be like, hey, what's up? And, you know, that's about it. I think, you know, that's the kind of guy Sam Darnold would be to me because I don't really think we have a lot in common and I don't I don't like him. His face scares me. I don't know. He scares me a little bit. Got Davis Mills. I think me and Davis would be friends. Oh, no, bro. That long neck, that scares me a little bit. I don't like it. It's scary looking. That shouldn't matter, but that does put him down a tear. I'm sorry, but Davis... Seem like a nice guy. I know you're not going to be the starter, but uh, yeah, we'll be friends, okay, bro? I, I'll be your friend. We've got Daniel Jones. I, I don't like Daniel Jones. I don't know why. He's just, look how, like, he has a punchable face. I mean, look at him, dude. He, like, basically asking me to punch him in the face. I don't know why I think that. He's just, I don't know. He's just probably really quiet. And just, does, and just sits in the corner of the lunchroom or he just sits in the corner of wherever we are and just doesn't want to talk. Yeah, that's what I think of him. Justin Fields, I would want to be his best friend, dude. This guy is so cool. Such an amazing quarterback. Such an amazing guy off the field, I've heard. Really humble. Really nice. Looks like a really fun dude to be around. Look at him smiling right there. I would want to be his best friend, and I would also want to be Geno Smith's best friend. I love this guy, bro. He is amazing. I loved his comeback year. Totally deserved comeback player of the year. Comeback strong with a Pro Bowl playoff appearance and comeback player of the year. This guy is so cool and so nice off the field. Doesn't look too happy here, but I would love to be his best friend. And same with Jared Goff, such a cool dude off the field and on the field. I don't know what's up with this guy, but he's so cool to me. He just looks like a fun guy. Look at his face, man. He's so cool on interviews and stuff like that. He just makes me just want to be his friend and just give him a hug. I don't know why, dude. I would love to be his friend, man. He looks awesome, and he seems like such a cool guy. Justin Herbert, I would love to be Justin Herbert's close friend, dude. Again, looks like a nice guy. Always has nice and positive things to say off the field. Love to be close friends with Justin Herbert. You know, be around him a lot, hang out, be bros, you know. Cool guy to be around, I think. Um, Tyler Huntley is not a starter. Jalen Hurts. Absolutely being best friends with Jalen Hurts, bruh. This guy is amazing. He got cheated out of a Super Bowl. I feel bad for the guy. Um, but... He's just awesome. I love his hair. I love his smile. I love his earrings. I love the dude off the field and on the field. I love his play style. And he seems like just such a humble and cool person off the field as well. I mean, like, what's not to like here? Jalen Hurts is a beast. I love Jalen Hurts. 
Jimmy G. I like Jimmy G. Uh, not because he's handsome. That's not the reason why. I like him. I don't know. He just, he looks nice. He just, I don't know. He just seems like a nice guy off the field. Like in interviews, he's like always really positive about his team. And he's always really nice. And those are the kind of people I want to be around, be friends with. So, yeah, I think I would lo I would like to be uh, best friends with, I mean, not best friends, close friends with Jimmy G. I would love that. And I would love to be best friends with Joe Burrow. Oh, my gosh. That would be amazing. I would love that. That would be amazing. I would love to be friends with Joe Burrow. He's so cool. He plays for the Bengals. He is such a nice guy. He seems so cool and so humble. Would love to be best friends with this guy. Kirk Cousins. Eh, I don't know. Kirk seems like a nice guy. He kind of scares me in this photo. I don't know. That kind of drops him down a little bit. But... He seems to be a nice guy off the field. I like his chains, you know. Justin Jefferson, he can convinced him to do that. But I like Kirk. I think he he seems nice. I don't know. I don't have anything against him. I'd say we'd be friends. I'd say me and Kyler Murray, we would be close. I love his play style as well. He looks like a nice guy. He seems like a nice guy off the field in interviews and stuff. And those are the kind of people I want to be around. Just like I said. Uh, Justin, uh, Justin Herbert and Jimmy G. I don't have anything against him. I think he's cool. I think he's a good football player. And I would like to be close friends with him. I think that would be great. Um, no. Never mind. Sorry, guys. Uh, Lamar. I'd love to be best friends with Lamar, bro. He was at the Pro Bowl handing out water and stuff. Being a really cool, chill dude. I'm loving that, man. Such a cool dude. Such a cool guy. Having his mom being his agent, I mean, like, that's so cool. I love it, man. Really humble about that kind of thing. Love those kind of people, and I love this guy, too. Trey Lance. Um, I'm going to say Trey Lance slash Brock Purdy. So I'm going to say I'd love to be friends with either of these dudes. Nice young men, especially Brock Purdy. Such a cool dude. Super humble, even though they lost in the playoffs. So nice, so humble, so cool about it. I love it. Cool people. Drew Locke, he's not a starter. Jordan Love, I don't know too much about Jordan Love, but he seems okay. He seems, he seems fine, decent, decent person. So I'd say he's, I'd be friends with him. I like Mac Jones. I think Mac Jones is a cool guy. I would, uh, I'd like to be his friend. I think being his friend would be pretty cool. Uh, plus the Patriots, pretty good team. Uh, yeah, I would I'd be friends with Mac. I think that would be cool. I would not be friends with this guy the biggest cheater on this earth who Needs to cheat to win Super Bowls do not like cheaters do not want you around me get away Get away get just get out of here frick you Anyways Titans starter Malik Willis. I don't know Malik I don't know. I just don't like Malik Willis. He's just He's just so meh. He's so average. I just don't like you. I don't know. Hey, okay? I'd be your acquaintance. Marcus Mariota. I also don't like him that much. I'd be his acquaintance. I'd be like, hey, bro, what's up? High five every once in a while. He's just not a likable looking person. And he just doesn't. I don't know. I just don't like him. I don't know. Hey, okay. I've got my preferences. You got yours. Matt Ryan is bad. He doesn't play in the NFL right now. Gardner Minshew he is not a starter but I don't care this guy is awesome I love his mustache love his hair such a funky and like weird guy off the field but a good weird like a really funny and cool weird I just think he's cool I think he's a great guy uh, he's not a starter Tom Brady absolutely who wouldn't want to be best friends with the goat the greatest of all time greatest football player I know he's not active, but bro, I love Tom Brady. Such a funny guy. Super cool and chill. He's my favorite player in the league. Uh, Kenny Pickett? I'd be close friends with Kenny Pickett. He seems cool. At least they don't have a rapist in there anymore. And Ben Roethlisberger. Anyways, uh, Kenny seems like a cool guy. You know, have him over a few times for some, I don't know, for some video game hangout time. Uh, Desmond Ritter, uh, I'd be friends with Desmond Ritter. I don't have anything against him. I don't really have anything for him. He looks like he's about 80 years old there. He literally looks like 50 years older than Tom Brady when Tom Brady's like over 20 years older than him. <laughs> Aaron Rodgers, 
See, I used to hate Aaron Rodgers, but I'd say I'd be acquaintances with him. I wouldn't really want to be his friend, but I, w I would say, like, hey, what's up, Aaron? And, the, you know, I'd be like, what's up, man? You know, give him a call every once in a while. So, yeah, I wouldn't want to be his friend, but I'd be like a kind of like a chill on the side acquaintance, you know. Russell Wilson, I would love to be best friends with Russell Wilson. Such a cool guy. So awesome off the field, helping children out at hospitals. And he, look how happy he looks, man. He's such a happy guy. He's going to do good things for the Broncos. Really cool dude since he's entered the league. We've got Matt Stafford. I'd say I'd be friends with Matthew Stafford. Don't have anything against him. Seems like, looks like a nice guy. Really cool player off the field. I was a little bit disappointed when they beat the Bengals in the Super Bowl, but that's just football. That's not him. That's not Joe Burrow's personality. They're just playing their game. I'd like to hang out with Matthew Stafford. I think he'd be a good friend. We got Ryan Tannehill. I'd be his acquaintance. I don't know. This guy's weird. <laughs> Teddy Bridgeshaw. Um, we've got Trevor. Absolutely, I'd want to be best friends with Trevor Lawrence. Bro, this guy is awesome. He loves to go to Waffle House. That comeback was incredible. Love his hair. Looks like such a cool dude. Such a shining, rising star in this league. Would love to hang out with Trevor Lawrence. I'd love to be his best friend. All right, we've got Tua. I would love to be a close friend with Tua. So, I think he's cool. Tua's a great guy, man. So cool. Really hope he gets better. Hope everything's going well for him after that bad hit. But I'd love to be good friends with Tua. Such a cool person. I don't know who that is. Deshaun, eh, absolutely not. I'm not even going to go over why I would not want to be friends with Deshaun. Carson Wentz. I don't like Carson Wentz. I don't know. He's just weird. I don't like him. I'm sorry. Uh, Jameis would love to be Jameis Winston's friend. I don't know why. He just seems so cool and fun, dude. I don't know. I love Jameis Winston. Such a, I don't know. You know, like, when you like somebody, but you have no idea why? That's Jameis Winston. Uh, Zach Wilson. I don't like Zach Wilson. And that is it for the starters. Technically, he's not a starter, but I'm going to put him in the hate him anyways. Anyways, guys, this is my opinion on who I would be friends with for NFL quarterbacks. Might do this with other positions in the future, but yeah... You guys comment down below and see if you guys agree with me or completely disagree. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe. You don't have to, and you can always unsubscribe. See you guys in the next video.